by the title says this is a tutorial on how to change your eye colours in Photoshop. And so first of all you're going to want to get your image. And I just got some random up Google. It can be any image as long as it's got eyes. And here it is. Open that. And first of all, you're going to want to make it so the layer is not locked anymore. So you can double click it and then just press OK. Then you're going to want to add a mask with this little button here. You add your mask, make sure it's selected so it's got the square things around it. Then you're going to want to select your brush tool and you want to go to like a decent size so it doesn't so it's yeah, it's a decent size so it ain't crazy. Then you're going to want to zoom in a bit, so I put it on actual pixels, that's usually a good one. And then you're going to just want to colour up draw on the iris. So basically you just put, click on the hold the click down. Hold the mouse button down, and then it'll do that. Yeah, then you just do it on both eyes. I'm being really quick here, as you can tell. That's why it's a mess. But you can fix it later on. Don't worry. And if yours is a mess, you can fix it later on. So it don't really matter. As you can see there, that is terrible. Look at it. It's horrible. But anyway, you can go to refine mask, and then you can mess around with these sliders if you want, and draw on it a bit more. I haven't got to bother because I just need to do this fast. And then, so, then you go to Add Master Selection. You might want to go into Select Tab and Inverse Selection. You can also use the keyboard shortcut. And then you're going to want to delete the mask with the right click it again. Delete Lay Mask. So it's got the selection there. You might want to add an adjustment layer with this thing here. And Color Balance. And you just mess around with the sliders until you get a decent color. And this won't be the final colour, because um, then you can change the opacity and stuff here, and change flow, until it gets something along those lines. Because you should get to blend in as much as possible, and that is really bad, and you can see all of the edges. <laughs> anyway, that's all you've got to do. You just go from that to that. Simple, easy, quick. Okay, so I've still got some time left, so let's do a recap. And first of all, you've got step one, which is to open the image and unlock the layer. And then you've got step two, which is to create the mask and draw it. And then you've got step three, which is to create the selection from the mask and then the delete the mask. And finally, step four, which is to add the adjustment layer and mess around with the sliders on that. And that is that.